One look at colorist Lee Eisman will tell you what the 2018 color of the year is. Well, ultraviolet is the color that we chose as color of the year. Lee is executive director of the Pantone Color Institute, a system designers, artists, and manufacturers all use to categorize colors so they're all speaking the same visual language. She has literally written the book on color. This would be her 10th. Lee lives on Bainbridge Island and travels the world spotting color trends. Nice job. But one of her main sources of inspiration is her own backyard. Nature first. It's always nature. It's one of the reasons why we moved to the Northwest. Every year, Lee and her team choose the hue that's going to be hot or cool, depending on where it falls on the color wheel. Past trending tones include Marsala, 2015, Rose Quartz and Serenity for 2016, and Greenery, last year's. 2018's color of the year, Ultraviolet, is already showing up in many products, and it has many meanings. Purple uh, has always represented a really innovative, creative frame of mind. Many artists have a proclivity to purple. They love purple. It's also a color that has a bit of nonconformity attached to it. Uh, it takes somebody that's a little bit more adventurous to play with purple. Think of Jimi Hendrix. Uh, you know, think of David Bowie. Think of Prince. It's also been a color that is thought of as kind of magical. There's a certain mystery that surrounds the color. It speaks of the cosmos, you know, what lies out there beyond where we are now. What does the future hold? With swatches instead of a crystal ball, Lee predicts what the future will hold. And right now, it's all about the color purple. In the purple family, you can see everything from Royal Lilac at the top, to Pansy, to Bright Violet, Amaranth, Purple Magic. But she won't say what color 2019 has in store for us just yet. She wants everyone to enjoy this year's Purple Haze. It is a dream job. It's all fascinating stuff, fascinating to work with.